Okay, good day everyone. This is Lacuna, I think it's pronounced. Lacuna? I'm not sure. Uh, it's a, all I know about it is it's meant to be like a detective type game and uh, it's pixelated and therefore it interested me. So yeah, <laughs> let's get into it. Your progress is saved automatically at certain points throughout the game. All progress since the previous save point will be lost when you quit. You cannot manually save the game or load a previous save. There is no going back. That can actually be a bit of a downer for recording because if something goes wrong, you can't go back. Never mind. Let's just hope nothing goes wrong with the recording, I guess. Okay, is this our character? Just overlooking the uh, Drovia Sector 2. 1800. Ah, oh, is it? Uh, let's take the walk. Okay. Okay, so I guess it's setting the scene. Not to use the stairs. Okay. Right trigger to sprint. Mirror over here. Hey, what's up? Uh, this icon on the bottom right indicates that you can move on with the dialogue by pressing A. Hey Noah, long time no see. Uh, I'm, I'm not going to do voices, I'm doing another playthrough at the moment that has voices and it hurts my throat. Anyway, uh, yeah it's been a while. I heard that the ship with new people arrived last night. I had a feeling you might be in there. Okay. How was your journey through space? It sucked. Felt like I was buried alive with my parents. You're headed downstairs, right? I'll come with you. So how was life on Drovia? I didn't really like it at first. There's not much going on here yet. Hard to imagine it's going to be like New Jordan one day. But when you think about it, it's actually pretty cool. What is? Making history and stuff. Conquering a foreign planet. Building the first ever savient col colony. Isn't that exciting? I don't know. I feel like I've seen most of this place already. Well, they're still building it. By the way, where do you live? My apartment's on floor minus eight, near the stairs to the common area. No way, you got one of those fancy apartments. I mean, ours is all right too. Dot, dot, dot. I think it's because my parents' job, all the scientists are in that area. Anyway, I've got to get back home. Uh, recess is almost over. Maybe you can show me around later? Actually, before you go, there is something I want to show you. Can you wait till this afternoon? I don't want to be late. Who cares? Come on. It's really cool. Today's my first day at school here. I don't want to make a bad impression on my first day. What do you want to show me? You'll see. It won't take long. Uh, okay, so use that. Yep, dialogue options. Later choices will be on a timer, which can be disabled in the settings. I've already done that because I'm not interested in... I end up... If, I, if I'm on a timer, I just end up choosing something because it's my choice. I don't actually necessarily choose it because it's actually what I want to say. It, it's difficult to explain, but I'm sure you know what I mean. Uh, I don't have time. All right then. All right then. All right, I'm curious, but let's make it quick. You won't regret it this way. Go, oh, follow Noah. I'm beating you. Ha ah. ha. 
Oh shit, damn it. Oh, you beat me. Are we allowed in here? The sign says that it's restricted area. We aren't, but I got the entrance code. Where'd you get that? My older brother works in there. He gave it to me. But it's not dangerous or anything. No, don't worry. Come on. See that elevator? It takes us halfway up to the dome. Oh, no, we're going to get caught. There's nobody up there. It's going to be awesome. You'll see. Come on. Fine, but if someone sees us, I'm going to tell them it was all your idea. Okay, is that us? In the silhouettes on the right hand side? I'm going to assume so. So what do you think? That was... Wow. Right? Did you see the entrance to the mines? Crazy how huge it is, huh? Yeah, pretty impressive. And your brother works down there? It's kind of scary thought. Kind of a scary thought. Really? I think it's pretty cool. Hey, wait a minute. Do you see the flag on these boxes? That's Gara's. So? Why are they bring stuff to our colony? Why wouldn't they? Maybe they're spying on our cool mining tech or something. Noah, Gara isn't our enemy. We trade with them and stuff. And besides, if you were unloading espionage equipment, would you print your face on the box? I... no, I wouldn't. I guess you're right. I really got to run now. Thanks for showing me this place. It's really cool. Glad you liked it. Don't tell anyone we went up there, okay? I'll get into trouble. I won't, I promise. Uh, hey Mira, I'm glad you're here. I kind of missed you. I missed you too. Oh, that reminds me. My parents gave me a new cell when we got here. We have to reconnect. Let's do it. And... Here we go. Alright, see you later. Uh, press options to open your cell. Oh, uh, this is your sales home tab. It shows your current objective down in the bottom left. Every conversation you have is logged in this tab to help you keep track of who said what. Okay, so oh, we can only do home and new and logs at the moment. Welcome back. We've got no missed news, no miss, miss messages, no new sheets. Okay, our pulse is 80, steps 157. Distance, okay. The weather, I'm not sure what that means. 24 minutes of cloudiness? No idea. Okay. Okay, alright, let's go this way. Run! Get me late for school! No! Can I talk to anyone? No? Can't seem to interact with them at all. Right. Well, I'm gonna guess that I'm going down here. A to interact. The camera is a bit. swayy. <laughs> It moves a bit much for my liking, but... Okay, nice credit sequence as we go down the elevator. Lift as we would say in the UK. Not that it matters. Oh, got some nice music playing. So I wonder what, like, why this is a detective game. Um, actually, give me one second. I'm going to read the 
read the um, description. Uh, if I remember, I'll, I'll loop the audio because I, when I when I um, tab out, it stops it. Anyway, um, a murder, a hack, a bombing. All it takes to plunge the solar system into war, unless you do something about it. Help CDI agent Neil Conrad make a string of increasingly difficult decisions in this modern dialogue-driven adventure set in gorgeous 2D sci-fi noir universe. Okay. So I, I just read the description, but I don't know if I'm going to keep it in. I might... I might not because it kind of it's a little bit of a spoiler I guess but then it's no much a spoiler than you would get if you went to the store page so who knows anyway oxy bar okay banana apple wide fruit blue ice what's your flavor okay uh, can't seem to actually choose a flavor all right I guess we're not hungry or thirsty a shipment of Kashi green caramel bars just arrived. Kashi? Ah, whatever. Um, annoyingly, the dialogue uh, sort of goes off the screen before I get a chance to read it. My reading skills really suck. My reading out loud skills, anyway. So, um, yeah. Anyway, no way. You have to deep. What? You have deep fried troop. See what I mean? Already size. Uh, no way, you have deep fried tulip f per fish. Okay, damn right we do. Any place in Androvia to serve it. You just arrived, huh? Yeah, it's my first day here. I'm so happy you served chupa. <laughs> it was my favorite dish back home. So you want some? Sorry, I'm in a hurry. School's about to start, but I'll be back this afternoon. Uh, sector 2 Okay, so are we going this way or are we going No, we're going down I've actually turned like the swaying off or at least the option for the camera to sway off but from what I can tell it still sways look at this uh, every, oh anyway get on with the game shall we Get on the computer. You get on the computer. Uh, I guess we're going up. A to talk. All right. Now that's everybody here. Myra, we can get started. Please make sure you to arrive on time in the future. Ah, uh, I guess that's because we went up to the thingy uh, and had a look at the view. Okay. This morning I walked you through our learning platform and showed you the curriculum for this year. You'll be taught about the same topics as you would back home. Today we're going to go over some basic facts about our solar system. This won't be news to most of you, but I want to make sure we all get on the same page. I already know all this stuff. I can skip this lesson and come back later. No, I haven't told you. What exactly we are going to talk about? Let me ask my dad. I'm sure he will write me a note. Plus it's mandatory for everyone, even for the son or chief security. I'm sure he'll agree with me. You're all given a map of the solar system as part of our school package. I can see that some of you have already put it up uh, on the wall. Very nice. Please take a moment to double check it. If it's there, you need, may need it for the next assignment. Okay, press Y to toggle your AR module investigation mode. Uh, once active, it will arrive. It will highlight nearby objects you can examine. To toggle, use the right. What? Toggle to the right using RT and to the left using LT. Then investigate using A. Please note that you cannot interact with anyone or anything while in investigation mode. Start the map. Uh, a little 
looks to be... Where am I? Am I the red dot? Got no idea. Safe room on the right. Okay. Not sure how that's any helpful, but... Uh, an emergency escape plan showing the nearest safe rooms. Oh, okay. Uh, hey, sweetie, we just missed you. Have fun in your class. We'll be back this afternoon, Mum. So I guess that's a note. Ah, uh, this... Is, okay. So we're on Drovia. They spoke about New Jor... Oh, I said Jordan, but it says Joran there. And then Kahara. I don't remember which one she said we came from. But whatever. Uh, a map of the six... And their moons. Okay. Back on the, uh, the old computer. Uh, looks like you will have the poster. It'll help you solve the task I'm about to give you. I also have another resource for you. An excerpt from the news article. I'm sending you both... Well, oh, don't make me jump. Uh, the sheet and the article now. Open your cell and check news and sheets tab. Submit your sheet once you think you've got it. Uh, okay, she opened the solar system. Objectives added. From time to time, it can be useful to stop and think about, think for a while. Some benches, sofas and chairs offer a place to sit down, take out your cell and go over everything you know so far. Ooh, uh, whenever you receive a news article, it is stored in this tab. Select it and view the latest news. The little bouncing icon indicates new cell content haven't seen yet. You haven't seen yet. Um, I might end up calling it mobile just because I'm in the UK and we call it mobile phone, not a cell phone. Um, again, it doesn't matter. It's not. I'm not trying to be a dick. I'm just saying it's difficult. Sometimes you just go into what you naturally. Well, anyway, uh, sheets are added to this tab of yourself, uh, select the correct answers and fill in the gaps, uh, when the sheet is due a submit button appears at the bottom, you only have one shot of getting it right, okay, alright let's have a look at the news, uh, yeah it is new Joran, okay, uh, commentary by Martha Bold, oh actually, uh, lithium will pass the torch, okay, for most of uh, for almost four centuries, lithium-ion technology was the be-all, end-all in battery technology. Up until recently, nobody would have predicted the sudden rise of Tellarium? Tellarium? Tellanium? Tellanium based energy storage. Just two years ago, scientists first succeeded in producing a Tellanium based prototype that would exceed its lithium counterpart in terms of storage capacity, weight power and longevity. How do I how do I scroll down? Oh I have to go over. Okay. Uh, when vast amounts of supposedly rare selenium ore were discovered under the crust of Drovia last year, a new gold rush rush began, the likes of which we have haven't seen since Gahara's first lunar colonies. Two very different factions, Gara and a group of sapiens migrants from New Joran, have already secured their spot on the planet's surface, eager to participate in the next technological revolution. Okay, oh whoops, didn't actually mean to come out. Okay, the solar system. Okay, so the first colony outside of one cradle of humanity was built in 1608. It was a small science based on Milun, one of the planet's three moons. Fast forward to today, humanity has conquered most of the solar system. The colonization of Drovia started only in about only about a year ago. Soviets from two, the closest planet to Drovia, have now established their own colony your new home sector too on Drivia. This is not this not only gives us savings from our own nation, but also access to one of the world's most sought after resources. Free. Due to technological innovations, the price of free 
has skyrocketed over the last year. Well, we, we know this one is Delinium. Uh, okay. Let's have a quick read of the news article again. Um, and I. Okay, so. Uh, discovered under the cross of Drovia. And then. Gahara. And migrants from New Jordan. Okay, so what's it say? Saving it from. New Jordan? Yes. Uh, the first colony outside of. Ah, oh, see, does that tell me when it was built? I am going to get my first one wrong. <laughs> um, my first test wrong. Okay, let's have another look. Um, the first colony outside of Kahara, sure. Um, Saviants from what, what was the Saviants from? They were from Neutron. Yeah. Fine. You know what? Let's just do this. I I don't think I've got number one right. But I don't know. Do you really want to submit? Not really, but I just want it. All right, Mara. I received the sheet. Let's go over it. First answer is correct. Okay. Humanity originated on Gahara and settled on the other planet from there. But second question. That was an easy one, wasn't it? Saving from New Joran that created their own colony and trivia. Now the last question, that's right. We are mining Delenium on Drovia. It's a very valuable resource nowadays. Good job, Mario. Looks like you have a grasp of this topic. Let's move on to the next. Hold on, what was that? Connection closed. Call interrupted due to an emergency. Structural breach detected. Please re like, re like, re like it. It's as quickly as possible. Down in 60 seconds, the rest of the plans have been distributed to all living units. Wait, what? Oh, fuck. Okay. Uh, go down. Right. It was on the right hand side, I know that. Um. Okay. Oh. What? Help. Hey, girl. Help. The door is stuck. I. Noah, Mira, come, we've got to hurry, we've got to hurry, but she, please, just grab the door and pull. Uh, it won't let me, what's happening? Oh, there we go. Okay, I was mashing A, but it didn't actually do much. Apparently I helped though. Come on, run. 30 seconds to lock down. Uh, yeah, here we go. I was going to say, I, I thought it was this floor. Mira, thank God you made it. No, oh, what's going on? Have you seen my parents? No, I... Oh, it's locked. Oh dear. Lacuna. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, but that's how I'm going to pronounce it. Even after 10 years, oh. meeting your ex still feels kind of strange. Or maybe it doesn't if you don't still have feelings for her. And maybe it doesn't if the whole world isn't on the brink of war. I don't even know why I agreed to see Cat that day. My thoughts were still lingering on my work. My unit was responsible for the safety of one of the most important visitors Yara had seen in a long time. Joseph Banny, foreign minister of Drovia. Whatever came of his negotiations with our president could make or break the relationship between our planets for generations to come. Yet here I was fighting with my ex about how often I should call my daughter, pretending that it mattered. Okay. Uh, Neil, did you hear what I said? Sorry, I got distracted for a second. Were you listening to the radio? I'm sorry, Cat. 
they were talking about Banny. Uh, this whole thing has really put me on edge. You haven't changed a bit. You know how important it is this time. Yeah, that's what I said every time. What you said every time. Let's go back to Laura. That's why we're here, right? I don't know what else to say. You never visit her. You don't even call her back. But being unfair, I watched that awful movie with her that you didn't want to see. Come on, that was over a month ago. You barely responded to her messages ever since. I don't understand how you can treat her like that. She deserves better. Dot dot dot. Honestly, I don't like spending time at our old place. What? Why? I don't know. What? It reminds our, me of our life together. Um, let's be honest, shall we? It reminds me of our life together, I guess. You never seem to care that much at the time. You keep telling yourself that, cat. Sure, I'm telling myself that. You were never home. I was starting out at CDI. None of us were ever at home. Whatever. We've been this, what? We've been having this discussion for over a decade. Laura's a teenager now, and it would be good if you, for her if she had a second parent to talk to. And good for me, frankly. Uh, look, I'll try to do better. Great. Why don't you go up to her right now then? She's home and I won't be bothering you. I have an appointment. Yeah, okay. Right now is already better. No, be good to your daughter. Bum hole. Uh, yeah, okay. Really? Laura will be delighted. Oh, I think something's going to interrupt us so we won't be able to. But anyway, I have to go now. It was good to see you. You too. Uh, I started walking home. I felt angry at myself. Good. Not for failing to show my daughter how much I cared for her, but for actually not caring as much as she would have deserved. At least that's what I thought I felt like at the time. I was under a lot of pressure due to Banny's visit, and I found it hard to think about anything other than work. I don't know. See you very see you soon. Yeah. Oh, there uh, she gets on there. Okay, so I'm going up here, I guess. Actually, what's my cell look like? Uh, Sector 2 incident, 40th anniversary. Uh, news by Given Gustafsson. Gustafsson, whatever. Today marks the 40th anniversary of the tragic Sector 2 incident, which put an abrupt and permanent end to New Joran's colonization efforts on Drovia. Uh, critical structural flaws, led to a series of explosions in the colonial mines which caused the big parts of the residential tunnels to collapse resulting in over a thousand deaths Ooh, uh, an instant an independent investigation concluded that the oversight of the construction project was part of new drawings public authorities had been dangerously ne negligent uh, following public outcry the pressure from independent in a pla interplanetary community, Neutron was forced to shut down its colonization project on Trophia for good. To this day, an amendment uh, ad I can't say that word, but I know I know what it means, to the Space Plat Travel and Planetary Protection Treaty of 1803 forbids the construction of another Neutron colony on Trevian ground. 55-year-old Mira Main and her husband Noah Main are among the incident's few survivors. Uh, Mira, I said, I meant Myra. Myra isn't, I think that film, that's us. But it says, and our husband, Noah Main. We, our now husband? Is that what they're saying? Because we weren't married. We were just a school child. I don't know, maybe, maybe, I'm, maybe I completely misunderstood who I was in the prologue. Anyway, uh, both were able to reach one of the new safe rooms, the few safe rooms, when the explosion started rocking the colony, narrowly, narrowly escaping certain death. My remains parents weren't as lucky. However, she spent the rest of her youth as an orphan in her grandmother's care. As she tells GNN, she still suffers from PTSD to this day. 
tune in tonight for our special installment when Maine recounts her memories of horrific tattoo incident. Okay, so if we come across the TV or something, make sure we tune in to GNN uh, so we can listen to my my remains uh, comments about what what happened. I would be interested to know, definitely. Uh, one second. Okay, and I'm back. Right. Uh, Mobile cell service. Okay. Look, this is what I mean by the camera sways. Look, so that's that's normal. Yeah. It's just, it's only subtle, but it really, really f doesn't feel good. Uh, anyway. A to visit Laura. Oh, uh, she's at least 10, I think. Oh no, they said she's a teenager. Um, okay. Hello, Laura. Hey, Laura. Oh, hi, Dad. Oh, uh, no, sorry. Oh, Dad, hi. You're working on your novel? Yeah, no, please stop looking at the screen. It's still very rough. What are you doing here? I thought I'd stop by and say hello. I haven't had much time for you for that lately. Uh, did Mum send you? No, it was my idea, kind of. Uh, again, let's be honest. Kind of, but she really sent... Well, she can't really send me anywhere. I came because I wanted to. Okay. Dot, dot, dot. So how's the novel coming along? Will I ever get to read it? I'm working on a different text right now. What? Okay. I haven't had much time for the novel lately. Uh, I'm in that writing contest. Don't you remember? I made it to the second round. Hey, not bad. That's great. I have to knock it out of the park because I have to make it to the finals. All the finalists participate in a workshop led by Hannah Slater. Why do I recognise that name? Well, anyway, that would be so awesome. I'm sure it's not meant to be a reference to somebody, but it does sound... Anyway, who is that? You don't know her? Seriously, she wrote The Tree and the Asteroid. She's the best. Sounds good. I'm sure you'll make it. At least one of us is optimistic. I need to finish this within the next few days, and it still sucks. I'll leave you now. Uh, I'll leave you to it then. Let me know... If you want to go and watch another movie. You did like the last one after all, didn't you? I hated it. <laughs> sure you did. See you soon, Dad. Okay. Well, does he count that as a good job done or something? I'm not convinced, but whatever. Uh, hey, where, where am I going now then? Objective walk home. Well, which way is home? A to download the news. A banning symbolic, symbolic visit. Commentary by Laura... Mm, no, whatever. <laughs> this morning, after a six-week journey through space, the most important guest of years and an interplanetary trade summit has finally arrived on Kahara's Trovers Forum, Minister Joseph Banny. As one of the most radical critics of Kaharian state and its colonial, colonial activities, yeah, see what I mean? I just reading out loud. Anyway, Banny has been fighting for more economic and political autonomy, autonomy on Drevia's part for a while. His central demand at the summit is expected to be Drevia's full emancipation from Gaharian rule. However, political observers don't expect President Robertson to give in to their demands. Do, 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 do. Drovia experts in Robertson's ministry declared themselves against granting the colony more rights and liberties, liberties uh, especially in the light of the Saviant's Front's growing influence in Drovia. The Saviant's 
Bront is an extremist branch of the Soviet religion and is fam infamous for defending backwards anti scientific positions. Dravian independence would inevitably lead to a stronger influence of this group in our solar, solar system. However, if Robertson doesn't want to escalate relations between our planets, he might be forced to find some, kind, find some compromises with Banny. Okay. No news. Oh my god. Um... A to buy cigarettes. In the post-cancer time, smoking is less lethal, but it's still an addictive lifestyle for many. Cigarettes can be bought all across the city. Your cell home, your cell's home tab list lists how many cigarettes you have left. Uh, the choice is yours. Help me quit smoking or enjoy some nice views of the city over a cigarette. I see. Okay. Department C minus fifty-two. I looked at my reflection in the glass and down at the layers of city below my feet. I wondered why I'd opened up to Cat about feeling weird at our old place. I didn't want her to think I still missed her. Maybe I did, because something still hurt when I saw her. Although it might just have been the memory of not getting something we wanted, of having failed. As good as we may be at making sense of things, there are some we can't work into the narrative. Okay, fair enough. Smart home. Uh, welcome, visitor. Mr. Conrad is currently not at home. It's probably because I'm standing in the hallway. <laughs> Would you like to leave a message? No, it's me, Neil Conrad, perform another scan. Scanning is not currently possible. Uh, please contact the system administrator for more information. Great, the scanner's probably busted again. I should check my cell, maybe I got notified about it. People will message you from time to time. Select this to view your new messages. Uh, apartment code A. Stevens. Dear Mr. Conrad, I hope you read this message in time. The building's ID scanning system broke earlier today and is currently under maintenance. As your apartment will not be able to identify you, you have to enter the backup key code, which is updated every month for security reasons. Your current code is 9064. I will keep you updated on the ID's system status i apologize for the inconvenience and hope hope the matter will be resolved shortly okay yep uh yeah yeah shut it i want to uh, pin please uh from time to time you may be prompted to enter a sequence of numbers into a keypad whenever the keypad symbol and sort from right lights up you can open it by pressing x once it's open Input the numbers using A. Ah, oh, okay. Hello, visitor. You entered the correct pin. Unlocking door. Go to sleep. Oh. Somebody's ringing me. Hey, Gary. So how do you... How'd that date go with your ex? Uh, perfectly. What do you think? Well, I hope it was worth ditching me. What's the situation? Our job's done for today. Fanny and his staff are with the President Robertson now. Uh, tonight they will be invited to dinner with some fat cats. Things went over smoothly, nothing out of the ordinary so far. But goddamn, Fanny's guys annoyed the fuck out of me. They didn't miss an opportunity to call us colonialists uh, one more time, and I might have punched them all in the throat. Uh, I'm just happy they're Johnson's responsibility for the rest of the day. Let's hope that we all get, uh, we're all getting along better after the summit. Uh, I'm not sure about that. Did you read the article about the trade summit in the news today? 
Yes. What about Robertson? Not really planning on giving Banny anything. They've been saying that for weeks. Let's wait and see. What else do you think will happen? Trevor the independence? If you ask me, Banny shouldn't get anything at all. We've built the whole colony after all. Anyway, the chief has scheduled a briefing tomorrow morning at nine. Don't be late. Copy that. See you tomorrow. Hey Horace, how's it going? Pet, feed, do nothing. Let's feed him. Here you go, Horace. Nom 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 nom. Okay. <laughs> Eat or smoke? Nah. I'm sure it's a nice view, but we're not going to do it. What was that? The glossary allows you to read up on important people and places you might need you know, if you might if you need a reminder. Come on. Uh. Well, there's a lot of reading to do. I think we'll leave that for next time. Uh, Catherine. Hey Neil. Uh, thanks for saying hello to Laura, even if she didn't show it. She's happy you swung by. Talk to you soon, Cat. Right, let's go to sleep. Huh. Interesting way of sleeping, but alright. Hello? Gone right, it's me. Everything alright? It's not, Benny's been shot. Huh? What? How? What's his condition? He's dead. Where are you now? He's dead? I asked you where you are, Conrad. I'm at my place. I'll have someone pick you up. You know I don't. It's a 50 minute train ride. I'll be right there. Make it quick. Okay, well, I think... Fuck, fuck, fuck. How could that happen? I didn't even dare think about the impending political aftermath. This was indeed murder. It couldn't be. I hope there was a mistake. Maybe Gary had gone crazy. Maybe I was dreaming. Foreign Minister Banny's death could be the tipping point in the conflict between Gyara and Drovia. This whole visit was meant to ease tensions between our planets. Now, now it could lead to war. The first interplanetary war. Fuck me, he'll snap out of it. He'll figure this out. Focus on the task ahead. Okay. Uh, well, that's where we're actually going to call it for today. I uh, hope you've enjoyed. Uh, actually, before I do that, um, this is an interesting start. Uh, in post, I might like change some of the voices. Uh, but yeah, as, uh, I'm not going to do voices myself because... My throat hurts when I do voices. Um, anyway. Um, yeah, so the next time we'll check up on Benny's murder scene, I guess. Um, anyway, hope you enjoyed. Have a good day, everyone. Hopefully speak soon. Bye.